Good morning. It is another Saturday morning and today I'm going to be fixing a mistake that I made. The last job that I poured when I was excavating it, uh, apparently I went onto the neighbor's patio a little bit and cracked it. So I already talked to him and we worked it out. So I'm going to cut off on a diagonal little piece and I'm going to pour it and it's really small. So what I'm going to end up doing is mixing the concrete myself and then pouring it so that'll that should be interesting so I will see you guys at the um, not the coffee shop I thought last time was my last job obviously but I just have to fix this and then I'll be putting all my tools away so I'm taking them all off the equipment trailer and putting them all on the 73 which is what I'll be using today someone's here to repair something and then I'm putting all my tools away all right I got all my tools from the land and I'm going to go to Home Depot to pick up the rental mixer if they have one and the bags of concrete and then I'm gonna grab my tools and then I'm going to go to the job All right, concrete's loaded. Time to get the mixer. Hey, how you doing, bro? Hey, where you, where'd you buy the camera? What's that? Where'd you get the uh, camera? Oh, uh, Best Buy? Best Buy? Yeah. Carlos, All right. Got the mixer. Now we just need to get the mixer in the truck. You need some help putting that in? Oh, if you want. Sure. Thank you. There Appreciate you go. it. No problem. And all the trucks are not over here anymore. It's completely bare. All right, I have loaded all my tools onto the truck. I think this is like all the tools that I own, more or less. I'm gonna pack them all away after today. Concrete's here. Nice. Gotta fuel up. I tried two different cards and I tried two different pumps and they all don't work back there. I need something on pump 18. I tried to do two different cards and it didn't work on either pump. So I don't right. know. It's, it's not, it's not gonna work. Well, I have to hold the card. You hold the card until you finish pumping. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. They gotta keep my card until I finish pumping. That's so stupid. I don't have time for all this monkey business. I don't think I'm gonna be coming back here for diesel. Oh great, and the thing's broken so it doesn't stay open. Very pleasant. This place is a dump. Yep, quick trip's definitely better. Mmm, nice. Well, it started. I hope it starts later today. Pulling up on the job. And that's the sidewalk right there. Clearly people been using it. Nice. I need to start out by snapping the line and cutting it, which shouldn't take too long. How are you doing? All right. Good. That look okay? Yeah, that should work. Yeah. So I'm going to cut it to start out okay. and then uh, put a form in and then mix it. So it's super small. So, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm glad because this is wedged in right there because this piece of asphalt was like starting to break off like a little bit because it's actually tarred or whatever that's called like right here. That turned out pretty good. I don't normally come back to my jobs to look at them too often. I'm going to be cutting with the concrete saw. So, safety first. I'm ready. Oh, you want me to put on my mask too? Uh, as always, safety first. Wow, this is very weak concrete. Like I'm barely hitting it. I know why this cracked. The whole thing's just splitting. This thing is junk i guess i can be thankful that it's junk because it's easy to take out but if it wasn't i probably wouldn't have to be taking it out but i choose to look at it the positive way i think daniel could have taken this out i can guess this has no reinforcement in it that's my guess and it's probably really thin look at that oh my goodness well there you go guys i'm gonna go get the wheelbarrow no use shoveling it two times yep about three and a half inches of concrete with no reinforcement. That's what you get.
All right, I got most of it broken up and the edge chipped a little bit. So I'm gonna have to rerun the line and then that should be that. And I can set the form quick and start pouring. Oh boy, that's not even close. That's ripping wide open. But since you started working, I lost my, my uh, internet and uh, cable. Oh. So I certainly hope you haven't hit any um, spectrum cable lines in, in this process. Oh, it's possible. As I see that it goes right under the concrete here, which is not how it's supposed to be. Yeah, because he was watching TV, I thought. So. Yeah, but he may not have uh, Yeah, sure. Spectrum. Well, I'll look here and then. I'll have to call him. Yeah, and that's why it would be cut, because it's going right through the middle of the concrete, which is definitely not how it's supposed to go. I wonder where it comes in. <sighs> oh, that's in and of itself super janky. You don't just have cords coming out of concrete. Well, I did hit it. Hi, where does your internet come in? Uh, I think down there. Because the neighbor came out and said that she lost internet because obviously i cut this it's going right through the middle of the concrete which is not how it's supposed to be no. i was wondering where it went in your wall i believe everything is is in the same area that this one is because they're not going to be able to fix that like any if i cut this anymore it's just going to keep cutting the line off they're going to have to like go around or something but this was just poured with the line right on top of the gravel which is unbelievable yeah I'm gonna leave this out. Uh -huh. I have no clue where that goes, uh -huh. but they're gonna have to redo wherever it goes in. They repair it for free. Uh -huh. You just gotta get uh, them to come out and, and reconnect it. It'd be nice for me to not say it's not my fault, but that's not the way it's supposed to be I done. Hear you. Yeah, I, hear you. I gotta get this poured today, so I don't even think like that would help if I left this open, cause like they're not gonna be able to connect it. There's no, there's no way they're getting this out and reconnected. Unbelievable. So they're gonna have to redo the line wherever yeah. it goes to. Yeah. Interesting. It's always something. Oh yeah. Spectrum. Apparently somebody had already called them. Oh okay. So they're gonna come out and correct the problem. Okay, very good. Are they able to come out today? Yeah. Oh wow, very good. Well, I could tell you something. What's that? This would be the strongest piece in your patio. Okay. Because I do it right. I hear you. Now I know who, who to call if I ever need <laughs> another patio. Yeah. Or who not to call. <laughs> right i'm gonna cut it again about an inch out because i chipped it right here oh, okay. yeah How's it going, man? uh okay okay yeah hi are you the spectrum guy yeah did you see any orange cables under there or anything oh yeah Oh yeah, they just did it t totally wrong. Whoever last poured did this, okay. poured it right in the middle of the concrete. You All can right. you can see that right here. Oh, that's okay. Like you can see, yeah, that's what it see looks right like. there. You're never gonna be able to oh, fix that. Yeah, Nick, they they literally ran it through the middle of the concrete. Yeah. So they cut the old concrete and it cut through it. Let Sorry. me get a quick picture of that. Yeah. Just to show that they ran that like that. I don't know if you if you need a cut those and then run them like around i don't know where it gets into the house he said maybe down there yeah because it looks like it goes right under there but we might be able to dig it up a little bit over here and sneak it in just for now yeah i'll have to talk to supervisors and everything yeah but i'm poor we don't cut this up like, yeah that up or nothing yeah i can tell you a pair just yeah up. yeah but i appreciate it yeah time to pour these bags are probably gonna rip wide open as soon as like i hope not if not oh well it is what it is only so much I can do, and there's a steady rain. Nice, nice forecast. Ah, uh, 
please don't knock anything because this is super precarious. All right, so I went home, changed my pants because they were all soaked and I actually got an extra pair of pants too, just in case. And I got more wood and more plastic because that plastic was really bad. So I'm gonna try to see if I can put this bigger plastic onto the roof or onto their deck, kind of leaning it on there. I'm not sure if it will work, no guarantee, but that would be awesome if it could. And I think it can actually. Wow, that, that'll be really good. I'll screw those two together and screw those to get the other two. Lean it over and then take this stuff on the bottom off once I'm done making the bigger one over it. <sighs> I didn't expect it to rain that much, but I did feel the concrete and it is firming up quite a bit, which is really good. It's kind of soaked in the water. Man, not as long a day by far as I was expecting, but it's okay. We'll get it done. Whatever we need to do. <laughs> yeah, this is actually kind of hilarious how this turned out. As long as I don't lose it, then it will still be hilarious. Regardless, probably will be hilarious next year. Do not want to cut this too short. Whatever I do. Let me see if that goes good. <gasps> that is perfect. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Gotta move everything out of the way now. Uh, yeah. Wow. All right, I've been sitting in the truck waiting for this to set up more. All right, so I kind of just finished it. It's still pretty sloppy, but I think I'm just gonna leave it finished kind of like this. I'm going to broom it. It's still too wet to broom, but this is gonna, this is gonna have to be my final finish right here, pretty much. That is what it is. And I'll come back in a little bit. I haven't eaten. I'm gonna go get something to eat. And then hopefully when I come back, I can broom it. I think what I'm gonna have to do is come back er really early in the morning to take down the wood and the forms because I can't take all that down right now. And in case it rains, it would get wrecked again. McDonald's. Hopefully they're still open. If they're not, uh, probably find someplace else. Maybe like uh, North Shore Bank. Find something to eat there. How long does your dining room stay open? Um, the lobby to the game. Sorry, what? Oh, it's okay. I don't think she can speak English. How long is your dining room stay open? Until uh, 10 o'clock. 10? 10 o'clock. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna get food through the drive through then. Hello? Hello? Hi, right, can you hear me? Yeah, no, great. I'm happy. Oh. Okay, next window, please. The spicy chicken sandwich uh, and the spicy was uh, media large. I don't think any workers around here know know English. I'm missing my fries. There's no fries in here. You charged me for the meal, right? Because I asked for the meal. No, I have a straw. Did you charge me? Did you charge me for a meal? Did you charge me for a meal? Because I asked for a meal. Because they didn't give me fries initially, but then I said they're missing my fries, so they gave me fries. So I'm just checking that I paid for the full meal. If I didn't pay, I can pay more, but let me know if I paid enough. Oh my goodness. I seriously don't think anybody on shift right now can speak English. Did you charge me for the full meal? No, it's only one. One. Yeah, one meal? Yeah. With the fries and everything? Yes. That's what you charged me? Yes. Okay, because they didn't give me the fries right away, so it's then... It's maybe a fry and maybe okay. a high seat. Yeah. yeah. They just forgot the fries, so I didn't know if you charged me everything to begin with. But if you charge me for the meal, then we're good. No meal. It's only sandwich. No, I asked for the meal. So do you so you want me to pay more? No, no, no. No. Okay. Alright. You have a good night. You know it's good when they have to collaborate to try to tell what you're saying. That was 
an experience. Wow. Wow, that's the second time today that I've seen a loader for snow in a parking lot. Apparently, tis the season. Oh, it's the same company. Yep, that was in a different parking lot. Wait a minute. The other one said $40 an hour. Why is this only $35? Because it's a little smaller loader or what? Maybe a different neighborhood. That's weird. Oi, 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 oi. Just kidding. It's only about 10 o'clock. Who needs coffee? Not me. I feel fresh. Woo, 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 woo. Let me see what happens when I broom it. Hopefully nothing too bad. Nope, that's a little wet right there still. But I broomed the rest of it. That should be okay. Mm. Go back and sit in the truck. Wait for the last little bit to be ready to broom. One eternity later. All right, I have to successfully take down this wood without breaking any windows. That'll be a feat. So, you might be able to tell, um, but this day didn't turn out like how I was expecting it to go. I don't know if you could tell that or not. Yeah, right. Some things are the way they are. Nothing you can do to change it. Okay, that actually looks a lot better. I'm happy with that. It just looked too rough over there. Too rough for my liking. Let's just do that side and be pretty much picture, picture framed. Picture framed. Yeah, yes, that is correct. I can barely speak at this time of day. Well, I have something to say. I wasn't planning on videoing this day, but it turned into a much wilder day than I anticipated. So I'm glad I videoed. All right, there you go, guys. That's it. I cleaned everything up, and I try to kind of broom around where the concrete spilled over, get the brush wet with water, and then and then carefully brush it. It's not the finest piece of concrete I've ever finished. That is for sure. And that's it. Good, the bad, and the ugly. All right, you guys, it's 11.54, so I just got done. That's not a.m., that is p.m., obviously. That was not how I wanted the day to go, but sometimes it is what it is, especially when you're working by yourself. I'll see you guys on the next one. Adios.